Ah, wala pala sound so. Good afternoon to all the Philippines na. No? Eh bago tayo mag-start, testing ko lang ulit. Ayun. Medyo matagal tayong nawala. <coughs> Let us continue our review. No? Aside from aside from what here ano aside for what are the reviewed before, no? Yung mga nandito, magdadagdagan pa natin yan. Pero for the meantime, <coughs> for the meantime, ito muna yung topic natin, no? Uh, ibabasahin muna natin yung nasa revised national planning. Lahat tayong gagawing iba, no? Hindi tayo mag-interpret. Ibabasahin natin. And let the reviewers uh, Anong tawag ito? Yun, na sana may matuto sila dito. No? And hope yung mga nakapasa na marami. No? Ang nakaraang taon, may nagpasalamat sa ating dalawa. And nung last July, may nagpasalamat sa ating apat na nakatulong yung channel natin sa pag, na makapasa sila sa Master Plumber World Exam. So, para hindi na tayo malagdagan ng maraming kwento. Yun, Ito po ang ating, meron tayong ina-offer na trainings, SketchUp, Primavera, and Bentley. Sa mga mag enroll gusto so mag-enroll, can comment in this video or yan, can email me, me Bryce at Academy, Consultancy at gmail.com. And to this number, 0976-0263125-0932-800-121. For the details of this software. training no and sa mga and to get access to membership perks to get access to the membership perks and click clicks the join this channel no click niyo lang po yung join channel yan and para sa mga benefits. And thank you very much sa so, nag-join nung nakaraang buwan si Joshua Christopher. Nag-join siya. Yun. And thank you for the new subscribers natin. From July 3 sa hanggang recent, no? As Edgar, Doc, Edgar Carlo Pascual, Klim Ivan Iligado, Bilain Mavano, Engineer Michael Sabal, Dennis De La Cruz, Sheila Cedron, si Pads Fadi, Jeffrey Castillo, Noel Di Mayuga, si Ibox, MJ Javier, Apol Lagitan, Jenny, Jenny B, Maurilio, Jan, Jan Pierre, Jerusalem, PLDS Garcia, and no Meruno. So sa next session natin yung mga August na nag-iulitin natin yan. Gigrip. Before we proceed, no, I encourage you to please subscribe to MCGI channel, the best principles economics, NCB, and MCGI channel. And for uh, yan, UNTV News and Rescue, ang sabi po dyan, Diyos ay aming sandigan, servisyo publiko ang aming pinahahalagahan. UNTV News and Rescue. Green print forever from for environmental planning board exam review. Okay? Tara po tayo. Ito yung coverage ng plumbing code, no? Chapter 3. Part 3 ng master plumber review. So, previously, kapat na tayo yung code of ethics, plumbing terms, permits, general regulations. Ngayon, chapter 4 tayo ng M... RNPCP, yung plumbing fixtures, no? Yan yung babasahin natin ngayong session. So, yan, para hindi na tayo magtagal. Chapter 4, plumbing fixtures. Revised National Plumbing Code of the Philippines. Plumbing fixtures, materials, and general requirements. Quality of fixtures... Plumbing fixtures shall be manufactures of dense, durable, non-absorbent materials and must have smooth, imp smooth impervious surface, 
free from unnecessary concealed fouling surface except as permitted elsewhere in this code. All pictures shall conform in quality and design to nationally recognized applicable standards or to other approved standards acceptable to the administrative authority. All porcelain enamel surface on the flaming pictures shall be acid resistant. For the convenience of users of these codes, a list of generally accepted flaming fixtures is included in Table 14-4, Flaming Material Reference Standard. Yan. Next one. Water closet bowls for public use shall be the elongated bowl, elongated bowl types. Equipped with front seats. Water closet seats shall be of smooth, non-absorbent material and properly sized for the water closet bowl use. Section 402, Material Alternatives. Special fix use fixtures may be made of soft stone, chemical stoneware, or may be lined with lead. Copper-based alloy, nickel copper alloy, corrosion-resisting steel, or other materials specially suited for the use which the fixture is intended. Restaurant, kitchen, and other special use sinks may be made of approved type vanderized and galvanized sheet steel of not less than gauge number 16. Number 16 US BNS or 1.6 millimeter thick. All sheet metal plumbing pictures shall be adequately designed, constructed, and braced in an approved manner to satisfactorily accomplish the intended purpose. Section 403, Overflows. When, nest, when any picture is provided in an overflow outlet, the waste shall be uh, so arranged that the standing water is inside the fixtures cannot rinse. Rise inside the overflow way when a stopper is closed nor remain inside the outlet the overflow way and the picture is empty. The overflow pipe from a picture shall be connected to the use to the house or inlet side of the picture trap. Water closet or urinal flush tanks shall discharge in the, to the bowls or weirs served by them but it shall be unlawful to connect such overflows with any other part of the drainage system. Section 404, strainers and connections. Strainers are plumbing fixtures other than the water closet, other than water closet, and seep on action, wash down, or blow out urinals. Shall be equipped with approved strainers having an approved waterway area. The strainers serving shower drains, shall have waterway equivalent to the area of the tailpiece, meaning the sum of all the areas of the perforations of the strainer is equivalent to the outlet area. Connections. Pixtures having concealed slip joint connections shall be provided with an access panel or utility at least 0.3 meter in its least dimension and arrange so that the connections are readily accessible for inspection and repair. Continuous waste and picture tailpiece shall be constructed from the materials. For sound check, sound check, sound check. 
Ayan. 4, 4, 0, 4.3. Continuous ways and fixture tailpiece shall be constructed from the materials specified on table 14-4. This code for drainage piping. Provided, however, that such connections were exposed or accessible may be of seamless draw brass not less than gauge number 20 BNS or 0.8 millimeter in thickness. Each such steel piece continuous waste or waste and overflow shall not be less than 38 millimeter OD for sinks, dishwashers, laundry stubs, bathtubs, urinals and similar pictures and not less than 32 millimeter Outside diameter for laboratories, drinking fountains, and similar pictures. Small pictures. Brass or copper shall not be used for urinal, urinal tail piece or trap. Approved Y or other directional type branch fittings shall be installed in all continuous waste connecting or receiving the discharge from food waste disposal units dishwashers clothes washers or other force discharge picture or appliances the dishwasher drain shall be connected to a sink tailpiece continuous waste or trap on the discharge side of a post waste disposal unit or Section 405, for Procure 5, Prohibited Fixtures. Use of water closet having invisible seals or unventilated space or having walls which are not thoroughly washed out or at each discharge shall be prohibited. Any water closet which might permit siponage of the contents of the bowel back into the water tank shall be prohibited as well as throw urinals. Drinking fountains shall not be installed inside public toilet rooms. Fix wooden concrete cement or tile wash trays or sinks for domestic use shall not be installed in any building designed for human habitation. No sheet metal line. Wooden bathtubs shall be installed or reconnected. No dry or chemical closet toilet shall be installed in any building for human habitation unless first approved by the health officer or administrative authority. Section 406. Special pictures and specialties. Water connection. Baptist trees, ornamental and lily ponds. Aquario, aquaria, ornamental fountain basins, and similar constructions, when provided with water supplies connected to potable water supply lines, shall be protected from back siponage. Waste water drain for sacrarium, cup sink at church altar, and baptistries font, font outlet shall discharge direct to the ground and not connected to the sanitary drainage system. Approved specialties requiring water supply and waste discharge connection shall be submitted for approval of the administrative authority. Installation cleaning plumbing picture shall be installed in a manner to provide easy access for repair and cleaning. For practical, all pipes from pictures shall be run parallel and close to the nearest wall or building line. Joints, where a picture comes in contact with the wall or floor, the joint between the picture and wall or floor shall be made watertight. Securing pictures, floor outlet or floor mounted pictures shall be rigidly secured on the drainage connection and floor and so designed with the use of adequately sized screws or expansion bolts of copper 
brass, or other equally corrosion resistant material. Wall hung fixtures shall be rigid rigidly supported by metal supporting members or chairs so that no bending or pull out strain is transmitted to the wall. Approved non corrosive screws or bolts shall be secure water closet and and urinal flush tanks and similar appurtenances. Setting. Picture shall be set level and in proper alignment with reference to adjacent walls. No water closet or BDA shall be set closer than 0.375 meter from its center to any side wall or obstruction nor closer than 0.75 meter center to center to any similar picture. No urinal shall be set closer than 0.3 meter from center to any side, of, side wall or partition nor closer than 0.6 meter center to center. Supply pittings. Supply lines or pittings for every plumbing fixture shall be installed to prevent backflow. Urinals. An approved vacuum breaker shall be protected every water supply to any to a urinal or other approved backflow prevention devices, device as described in Table 14-4. Automatic flush tanks. More than one urinal shall be automatic in operation and of sufficient capacity to provide necessary volume of water. Flush and properly cleanse all urinals simultaneously. Automatically controlled flushometer bulbs may be substituted for automatic flush tanks. Flushometer bulbs. No manually controlled flushometer bulb shall be used to flush more than one ur urinal. And each such urinal flushometer bulb shall be approved Self closing type discharge, discharging a predetermined quantity of water. Floor drains and shower stalls. Floor drains shall be considered plumbing pictures, and each drain shall be provided with an approved type and hinge strainer, strainer plate having the sum of the areas of the small holes of the strainer plate or gross waterway is equivalent to the construction area of the tailpiece. Floor drains, floor receptors, and shower drains shall be of an approved type. The body provided with integrally cast water stop outside plunge around the body at the mid-depth and with an inside cock outlet to provide a watertight joint in the floor. Shower receptors are plumbing fixtures and shall conform to the general requirements therefore contained in table 14-4. Each shower receptor shall be constructed of vitrified china or earthenware, ceramic, tile, porcelain, enameled metal, or of such material as may be acceptable to the administrative authority. No shower receptor will be installed unless it conforms to the acceptable standards as required by Chapter 14 of this code or until a specification of a prototype or bot of such receptor is first submitted to the administrative authority for approval. Each shower receptor shall be an approved type and be constructed to have a finished dam curb, curb or threshold with at least 25.4 mm lower than the outside floor at the sides and backs of such receptor. In no case, any dam or threshold be less than 51 mm nor more than 228 mm in depth when measured from the top of the dam or threshold to the drain of the dam. The finished floor of the receptor shall slope uniformly from the sides toward the drain, not less than 2% or 
20 mm per meter or 4% or 40 mm per meter. Threshold shall be of sufficient width to accommodate a minimum 559 mm wide door. Okay. Exception. Special shower compartment for wheelchairs. Use may eliminate the curb or threshold. Required slope and depth shall be maintained from the door entry to the drain opening. The minimum distance between the door or entry to the drain opening shall be 1.2 mm. All shower compartment, regardless of shape, shall have the minimum finish interior area of 0.6 square meter and shall be capable of encompassing a 762 millimeter diameter circle. The minimum area and dimension shall be maintained from a point above the shower drain to a height of 1.78 meter with no protrusion other than a fixture bulb or bulbs, shower head and safety grab bars or rails. When the constitution construction on of on-site built-up shower receptors is permitted by the administrative authority, one of the following means shall be employed. Shower receptors build directly and onto the ground. Shower receptors built directly on the ground shall be watertight and shall be constructed from approved type dense and absorbent and non-corrosive materials. Each receptor shall be adequately reinforced Provided with an approved planch floor drain designed to make a watertight joint in the floor and shall have smooth, impervious, and durable surfaces. Shower receptor build above ground. When shower receptors are built above ground, the subfloor area and rough side falls to a height of not no less than 76 millimeter above the top of the pinch dam or threshold shall be first lined with a sheet lead, lead or copper or with other durable and watertight materials. All lining materials shall be fitch slope of 2% or 2 20 mm per meter to whip holes in subdrain or of a smooth and solid form sub base. All lining materials shall extend upward on rough jumps, slower opening to a point no less than 76 mm above the top of the pinch dam or threshold and shall extend outward over the top of the, the rough threshold and be turned over and passed outside the face of what the rough threshold and the jumps. All metallic shower sub pans or linings may be built up on the job site of not less than three layers of lay of standard in grade 6.8 Kilogram asphalt impregnated roofing felt. The bottom layer shall be fitted to the form sub base in each succeeding layer, layer thoroughly hot map to that below. All corners shall be carefully fitted, strengthened, and watertight by folding or laughing, and each corner shall be reinforced with suitable metal to webbing hot map in place. All folds, laps, and reinforcing webbing shall extend to at least another one millimeter in all directions from the corner and all webbing shall be of approved type and mesh producing a tensile strength of not less than 0.9 kilometer kilo, kilogram per millimeter in either direction non-metallic shower sub pans or linings may also consist of multi-layers of approved equivalent materials suitably reinforced and carefully fitted in place on the job site as elsewhere required in this section Lining shall be properly recessed and fastened to approve backing so as not to occupy, occupy the space required for wall covering and shall not be nailed or perforated at any point which may less be less than 25 mm above the finish dam or threshold. An approved type of drain shall be installed with every shower, sub pan or lining. Each of sub drain shall be of the type that sets flush with the sub base and shall be equipped with a clamping ring or other device to make a tight connections 
between the lining and drain. Subdrain shall have with holes into the waistline. All shower lining materials conform to the approved standards acceptable to the administrative authority. Floors of public shower room shall have a non-skid surface shall be drained in such a manner that wastewater from one butter will not pass over areas occupied by other bat butters. Gutters in public or gang shower rooms shall have rounded corners for easy cleaning and shall be sloped not less than 2% toward the drains. Drains and gutters shall be spaced not more than 4.9 meters apart. Ulo, saan na ba? Wala tayo. Yan. In the absence of local regulation, showers, occupancies, other than dwelling units served by individual water heaters shall be provided with an individual shower control bulbs of the pressure balance or that thermostatic mixing bulb. Multiple or gang showers may be controlled by a master thermostatic mixing bulb in lieu of individually controlled pressure balance or thermostatic mixing bulbs. Limit stops shall be provided on such bulbs and shall be adjusted to deliver hot water with a minimum temperature of 48.88 degrees Celsius. Lead and copper pipe Copper subpants or lining shall be installed from all conducting substance other than their connecting drain by 6.8 kg asphalt felt or each equivalent and no lead pan or liner shall be constructed of material weighing less than 19.6 kg per meter squared. Thickness of copper pants or liner shall be at least gauge number 24 BNS. 0.5 mm thick. Joints in lead pans or liners shall be burned. Joints in copper pans or liners shall be soldered or raised. Plumbing pictures required. Each building shall be provided with sanitary facilities as prescribed by the National Building Code or other authorities having jurisdiction. The absent of local requirements, a recommended list of minimum facilities for various occupancies is given on Table 4-1 of this code. We are pool, but tabs, unless... Listed, all wearable bathtubs shall comply with the following requirements. A removable funnel of sufficient dimension shall be provided for access to pump. Circulation pump shall be located above the crown wheel of the trap. The pump and circulation piping shall be self-draining to minimize water retention. Suction fittings or wearable bathtub shall comply with the listed standards. Yon, Diyan po natatapos yung chap section 4 ng RNPCP and the next oh, ang next topic natin ay chapter 5 no, hindi na 4 no. Inspection and test. Ito yung sunod nating topic. Yan ang next. Inspection and test. No? Chapter 5. Hindi ko lang sana edit. So editing ko na siya. Oh, nakalagay kasi dito, table for dash 1 minimum facilities. Ah, sorry. Tama po yan. Tama pala yan. So, yan yung susunod na topic natin prior to chapter 5. Kasi nasa take, masyadong mahaba ito. Ano? Haba na naman ang tinapik natin. No? Ilang minutes na tayo? Peta, almost, eh, 30 minutes na tayo. <laughs> Medyo na ano ako sa yung booking nilamunan ko. No? Pasensya na kayo. No? More comment, suggestion, and correction. Pardon me kung medyo mabagal, mali ng pagbasa, or whatever comment na no, negative or positive man. Okay lang yan. Sa comment lang po kayo dito. And you can comment in these videos and other videos. No? Mga hindi pa po nakaka-subscribe, please subscribe to Bryce Academy and Consultancy no? at Bryce AC. No? For more 
engineering software, software review, engineering topics. Yan, master plumber review. Marami pa, no? Marami pa tayong gagawin. For the meantime, yan muna, no? Nagbabasa tayo pa unti-unti. Pero gagawin ko siyang alternate. Pwede yan. Chapter, tas table, then Q&A, no? Para hindi naman kayo mag-boring matapos yung mga reviewer natin. Aside for the reviewer that even though we've I've been already finished, no? Yun. Okay, niulit ko lang. So, mga interested, no? I'm offering software trainings, no? Oracle Perima Vera Physics, Bentley, no? Stad Pro BTI and SketchUp, no? For the, yan, for inquiries, yan, you can email bryce.academy and consultancy at gmail.com or contact me in that number, no? 0976-0263-125-09328-101-21. Oh, for... Yan, sa mga susunod nating topics, no? Don't forget, no? Until next time, next time. See you next time. Thank you very much and have a great day.